Hello guys, and welcome back to another episode of my Savage Lands Let's Play. When last we left off, I was starving to death, I still am. But, um, I went out and there was a little bit of loss of time between the last episode and this one. Well, I collected some wood back for the file, and, uh, some of the food respawned. So I've got some of this meat here, which will hopefully keep me alive a little longer. My plans are, in the previous episode, I left some sinew back at the village. I'm going to make a break for the village and using the meat to keep me from dying from cold and hopefully not starve to death. And I'm going to try and uh, find that piece of sinew and so I can uh, build that hammer that I had enough stone to build for now, which I believe I still do. Indeed it is so. Let's move out. I better hurry before I die. Just me or the walking animation seems better than before. They have updated the game since the last time I played. I best be moving before I get myself killed. Look at the stars. I think I should eat a piece of meat right after I reach 10% on my cold. Okay, we're still good. Time to keep going. I'm pretty sure it was this way. Just keep walking straight. Uh, I haven't seen any wolves yet, but a lot of people have talked about them. I hope I don't run into any. Game, please. I see a wolf. I see two. No, it's just one. Wait a minute, I can get some food. The wolf meat. That might be a good idea. Alright, screw that plan. We're getting this wolf meat. Maybe I can kill that deer too. Me. I need to head back to camp. Too cold for me. Maybe I'll go after those deer if I warm up. They really have made some changes this game since the last time. There's only been like two updates since last time. But it, it seems better now. Certainly the hand animations with the food are much better than they were before. I take it that was a dire wolf. Oh god, no. Please, why do you have to do this to me? Why you add fog in the game? I don't need this. Wrong button. Kinda hope this uh, meat actually isn't bad for me. Okay, that's no good. I hope the poison effect goes away while I'm in trouble. Please tell me this goes away. Oh god, I'm in so much trouble. I'm still warming up by the fire, right? This is gonna be a really shitty way to die. I hope the poison doesn't last forever. I mean, it would make sense to last a while, but hopefully not indefinitely. Oh great, I don't seem to be warming up by the fire anymore. 
Oh god, the poison's gone. Ooh. Well, I'm still alive. Okay, the fire's warming me up. Okay, I've got some some food now, so that's good. I, I will definitely survive for a good bit longer, as long as I don't make any too, too many sudden movements, but uh, this is definitely an issue. I don't know how long the night's going to last, but I hope it ends soon. I'm not sure if it's worth risking a trip back to the camp. I still see those deer in the ocean. Fuse, my hands have left. My hands and legs have left. After I warm up, I need to consider my next course of action. The journal seems slightly different, so I guess I'll take a look. I gotta stop doing that! I gotta go out on a limb here and assume that I kill like a deceased dial wolf or something. Because as far as I know, normal wolves just drop wolf meat, not diseased meat. Yeah, I just need one sinew. Wait a minute, can I make sinew out of that pelt? Okay, it looks like I can't make shit out of that little pelt. Guess I better start trekking out. I don't... I don't really have time to sit by the fire. I see some more wolves on the horizon, I better avoid them. Especially if they're the same kind as the other one. If they drop normal meat, then I don't mind fighting them. But if they're just more that decayed, strong, dumb. No god, please no. At least it didn't poison me. I'm probably pushing my luck as bad as it is. Right? Let me get back in the fire before I kill myself. My axe is really, really low. This is not good. Oh, I should use it to get some more wood. I'm actually beginning to think that it gets cold because my temperature has gone down too high. Or too low, I should say. I'm pretty sure the sun is rising, but I can't tell through all the smoke.
Well, at least I'm still alive. Alright, well. I'm beginning to regret putting so many logs and pieces into that one house. But hey, if I ever get it fully built, it'd be nice to have. I could have probably built it closer, to be honest. Damn, so much of that stuff looks cool and I feel kind of so crappy that I can't build any of it. Looks like I wasn't wrong. I'm pretty sure the sun is rising, assuming that's it over there. It's kind of weird to be able to see both the sun and the moon simultaneously. Don't know if that's intentional or not or whatever. Well, I mean, my hunger should last me a while. It could be doing better, but I'm still very much alive. It is definitely becoming daytime. This is good. I'm thinking of traveling down the shore the way I came before. The meat I had received during the beginning of this episode um, came because it respawned. The meat respawned in the previous location where I had found some food here last time. Um, so if that's true, then the stuff on the beach may have respawned as well. And it has appeared to be changed in daytime, which is good. Like I said though, I need to get just a little bit more wood. I take it back, I'm actually okay. I think. Yeah, I'm okay. I kind of don't think the wolves are actually going to go away even though it's daytime now, even if I really wanted them to. But at least I'm doing better. Sorry if I'm waiting around the campfire way too long, guys. Uh, I just don't, I'm just worried about dying. Every single venture I've taken now so far has been pretty perilous. But if it really is daytime, then it, I guess it's worth going out. We'll see how low my, uh, my temperature goes when I leave the campfire. That's a deal? At first I wasn't sure, but it seems to be harmless. It's, I want to kill it, but... But, uh... Can't really afford for this axe to break. Come to me! Oh yes, this deer has just saved my life. Praise be the deer. Hey! You going on a great migration, my friend. Damn, what is this scene? Alright, now we're talking. Excellent, now we have more sinew. Let's get down to business. Yeah. 
Okay, I need to cut some stone up. No god. Why this wolf gotta be so darude? At least he giveth of meat. Okay, that's good. Let's uh, get a move on. I'm trying to remember where there were some rocks. I know there's plenty all over the place, but... Armed with my trusty hatchet, I say, we make a return to the village. My clothes, my beautiful clothes. You pay for this. Damn. Hey, that's so horrible, isn't it? So hobbles, I don't have time to play, so see you around. I have much respect for you, but I have business to attend to. We'll meet again later. One going. That nice new sound effect. Get more wood. Praise the holy sticks. All right, now we're talking. I can't believe I survived, to be honest. It's pure luck. But I'm certainly glad I did. I was hoping not to die. Hey, if things go out great, I might even be able to explore the tower soon. Okay, 
I need some more stone. I see you, Hobbles. Don't think you can sneak up behind me. Hobbles, don't force me to use force. Alright, I see how it is. You wanna go? Hey, you're no longer bleeding anymore. Aw, oh, I missed the bleeding. I think it's time to get a move on. The village was this way, right? I could have sworn it was this. Yeah, there it is. Just came at it from a weird angle. Uh, hopefully we would have rearmed myself with some stuff here. I hope my stuff I left over here is still here. Yup, I still see it. It's right there. There's some stone. There we go, clothes. Now I wonder if the tree nuts respawned. Those bones though. Sweet, a second hammer. Things look like they may be turning out for the better. I feel like there were some skeletons nearby. I knew it! Time to beat a hasty retreat!
Sorry, hobbles, don't have time to chat. Let's see, I'm pretty sure I came from this way. What was that? What's a bullet's tusk? Okay, let's keep going. Want to make it back to camp. Damn it. All these axes. God, I hope the camp was this way. Better get moving. I think I see it, but I can't be certain. When I land on the shore, I check both sides. It should be nearby. Still early in the day, which is good. Did I come from the wrong side or? Yeah, this is the spawn. I'm pretty sure the campfire was the other side. At least I've got a lot of stone now. I'm almost 100% certain it was this way. I think I see it in the distance. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is it. Home, sweet home. You are so close and it's so far. Man, I'm glad things turned out the way they did. Alright, definitely set up now. I guess I'll stockpile some of my axes here. We have to sort out this mess of inventory. Uh, I actually you know, I should put it in the house.
Actually, why don't I finish the house first? I'll drop this stuff by the campfire. Alright, the house is complete! Sweet, door and everything. I wonder if I can build a campfire in here. Doesn't look like it, but I can still store stuff in here. I think I'll construct some items just so I can make use of the stone without just leaving it around. There we go. Okay, let's store some of the extra stuff in here. Okay, so this will be my spare supply of stone hammers and hatchets. Actually, let me keep one of each with me and I'll use them up first.
There we go. I need to stockpile and get more stuff from the deal. Alright, this is great. I've got myself stockpiled with some extra supplies. The house is finished being built. I've survived the night and I've gotten myself some nice new tools. We also re explored the village and accomplished quite a lot. I'm really happy that I actually survived this far without dying. And I'm interested. I want to gather more resources, hopefully with this new hammer I built, and construct myself hopefully steel armor and a nice shiny sword. If I manage to survive long enough to get these things acquired, I think it'll be time to take a trip to the tower and have a tango with the dragon. Well, it's been great so far. Uh, I'm glad for you guys sticking with me. And I'll see you in the next video.